Hey my friends, this is Fabian Anlicker and welcome to this video. Today I want to show you how you can easily create an e-cover for your ebook, for your software, for your video package or whatever. Whenever you want to, some, to give something away or to sell something and you want to have a nice e-cover and you don't know how to do it, I have here a page for you and want to quickly show you how you can do that for almost free in some in some cases it's even free in some other cases it's like five bucks so if you don't want to go to Fiverr or give it to a professional designer and pay even more and you want to do your first trial here then I would really recommend to go to this page and it's called, as you can see here, it's myecovermaker.com If you are here for the first time you have to sign up for the page which doesn't cost you anything and then I'm already logged in here so I go to the dashboard and what you can see here is uh, already some e-covers that I have created now let me click here uh, for example, you can do e-covers and you can also do banners or packager. In this example, I just want to show you how the e-cover works. So you click here. Then, as you can see here, the first line here, that's free. So if you want to create your first e-book, a giveaway, I mean, you could just go for this one here or this one or just choose any of them. If you scroll down here, you can see those are not free anymore. For those, you would have to pay $4.95 in the end if you are finished and you want to download it. You also have, uh, if you go further down, like software packages. Then you also have uh, DVD packages, CD packages, or also with uh, iPhones or iPads or Samsung Pads, whatever it is here. So you actually have a quite good choice here, even on, on TV screens. So, or it looks like a, a credit card. So you have lots of opportunities to create e-covers. Now let's go for this free one here. Let's take this. So as you can see here, you can you could download an offline an offline guide, size info. You could preview. So if I click here, you see it on a bigger screen here, and then finally you can create this cover. So let's do that. The first thing you have to do is choose the background. Let's just go with something easy which is not too distracting yeah I'm gonna take this one it's, it's really an easy one just a grey background then you could still if you have any pictures in here then you could move it around so we just take it as it is select and continue the next thing you want to do is uh, add a text for example so Let's say um, five traffic resources you definitely need to know. Just an example here. Let's do this here. What you can do here is now you have different possibilities in the layout here you can the alignment do on the left central right then you have also the colors you can choose the font you have quite some fonts you can choose here let's take this one here and then you also have text effects if you want to add an effect here I mean we can do that with take this one then add text. This might take some time because it needs to create the text and also the just the effect that we that we chose before. So this definitely can take some seconds to create. Now as you can see it's really really big. 
what you need to do is you move it around a little bit until you see this here and then you can just make it smaller and even more so you have to move it around a little bit okay doesn't look that nice in this example here huh but it's just something that I want to show you so let's just delete this and add a new text so five traffic sources you need to know we take out the effect we just take this here add this should go much faster yep now also here shift it around a little bit exactly so that's the first thing then what we can do is we insert an image there you have different tabs so you have either the graphics you can use here let's say okay we have a bestseller here we just add this here on the top right make it a little bit smaller so okay then we add another image we could also go here to abstracts or shapes if you want to add one of those shapes then the nice thing is here under stocks you have some of those professional pictures that you can use for free it's not a lot but it might be that you find something so even though it's not related I'm just gonna add one of them like the group of people here just as an example I'm gonna put it here make it a little bit bigger and then on the bottom insert another text that would be the signature because I am the creator let's do it in this here it's also gonna be big of course you can also change the color to black to whatever you like to this is just an example that I want to show you how it works then the next thing is actually already you can go to finalize if you just want to do any more changes you just mark it here you go to edit then you can do the changes so let's say you want to change the color or you want to change the font or anything the outline let's say we change it to this one so make it a little bit more bold okay that's it and then we click on finalize and now the magic happens that also takes a while to create because now it creates a 3d picture which you can then download let's see how it looks like and here we go it already looks nice I mean in the end I would probably change here the color to black and here you could actually keep it in red or whatever you can change the size of the picture you can add other pictures whatever you want to and now you have the choice actually to download it in 3d or you can click on 2d so that would also only be this one and click on download and then you already have the file locally on your pc and then can use it on your sales page or wherever you want to then you can either click here a new to create a new cover edit the cover or close which brings you back to the dashboard as you can see here it's already added this is an example that i just created before and this here would be an example of a pad version if i go here to download you will see it in a in a full screen as you can see you also have this here this ecovermaker.com so if you want to download it it doesn't look nice so you have to first buy it to this to have this text here disappeared so if you create one of the 
the templates that I showed you before where you have to pay it would look like this until you buy and pay it and then you would have the whole picture without this ecovermaker.com can download it and use it as your cover so and here for example I created one which I paid already then it looks like this like a software box so as you can see there are lots of possibilities with different ebook styles with software boxes with CD or DVD boxes so it's really easy to create it's fast and uh, I mean 495 is really not a lot of money and it's definitely worth to create an e-cover if you have a, a product that you sell or you want to give away it's always converting better if you have a nice e-cover it doesn't need to be perfect or a professional one if you're just starting out and you don't want to spend more money for a professional designer I would go for this version as you see it's easy to do, it's fast and definitely worth a try. So thanks for watching the video today and see you in the next one. Goodbye.